process which is there is that the training institution normally writes to the medical board or nursing board or poisons and pharmacy board asking for them to evaluate the hospital that they want it to be a training institution. And we waited for Kenyatta University to write that letter to the medical board, nursing council, and they, they did not write for two years. I don't understand why the university did not write, because that's a requirement and is 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 as per the practice. So a few months ago, uh, in her wisdom, our minister intervened, our minister, Madame Nakumicha, she intervened and actually instructed the medical board and the nursing council to come and inspect the hospital with a view to checking whether we are ready. So chair and honorable members, the medical board came, the nursing council came on the instruction of our honorable minister and they inspected and actually as we talk now we have accreditation which we have put it in the document. We are accredited for the nursing students, we are accredited for the medical students. My major responsibility is to make sure that there is a conducive running environment for all our students in the universities. And indeed, Kenyatta University, our medical students, that is top on my agenda, that they have to access uh, not only Kenyatta referral and the teaching hospital, but also the hospitals around so that the doctors we produce for this country and for the world at large because they don't only work here but they work also in other parts of the country they get the very best.